Hello and welcome. I'm Diane Craig. Executive dining etiquette is a little bit more than knowing how to handle a myriad of flatware. It is, being, it is all about being a hospitable host and a gracious guest. Let's talk about the invite. When you invite someone for a business meal, be clear about the purpose of your invitation. So, I am inviting you, Mr. Klein, because I'd like to thank you for your business. I'd like to show you a new product we are carrying, or we would just like to get in touch with you, connect and see what's happening in your organization. Then it is also important to, perhaps if you can, get there in advance to handle the bill, because I assure you, even though we know that who does the inviting does the paying, when the bill comes to the table at the end of the meal, it is always an awkward moment. So um, if you take care of it from the beginning and say to the server, you know, um, towards the end of the meal, I will come and settle the bill with you. Uh, you can even give them your credit card right there and then if you wish. And uh, then when the meal is over, you can just go and sign the bill. And it is so appreciated by the guests because we never have to say, well, let me perhaps share with you and so on. And then it is important that you show the extent of your hospitality. Uh, are we going to have an appetizer? Are we going to go straight to the main course? Are we going to have wine or not? And by showing the extent of your hospitality, it puts you in control and your guest is totally at ease knowing exactly what he can have, what he can't have, and how the meal is going to unfold. As a host, you will signal the beginning of the meal by taking your napkin, putting it on your lap with the fold against the waist. Another important point to know about the table setting is solid on the solids on the left, liquids on the right. So an easy way to remember that perhaps is using BMW, bread, meal, water, or wine. Then let's talk about how we are going to handle the flatware. So the knife goes in the right hand, the fork in the left hand. As you see on the slide here, you turn over. There are two styles of eating, the North American style and the Continental style. The North American style is when we switch, meaning that the knife is in the right, in the right hand, the fork in the left hand. We cut, we put the knife down, switch the fork to the right hand, time's up, and we eat. The Continental style is different. We do not switch, so the knife remains in the right hand and the fork in the left hand. We cut, but then we bring the food to the mouth with tines down. Now, when it comes to the dessert, your spoon is actually going to become your knife. So you're going to secure the dessert with the fork, use your spoon in front of the tines of the fork to cut. Push the food into the bowl of the spoon and eat. So that's a wrap for us today. So remember to end the meal by having some small talk, really like conversation, and thank your guests for joining you. And you as a guest, remember to send a thank you note within the next 24 hours. Thank you.